In this session we're going to have a look at how to find the equation for a perpendicular uh, to a given line through a given point. And we're going to use the, the line which I used in the previous video which has um, equation 2x minus 1y is equal to 3. And the chosen point has coordinates 6, 2. So we're looking for uh, a line which goes through 6, 2 uh, which is perpendicular uh, to this uh, given line, so it goes through, goes through here. And uh, the sutras involved are transpose and adjust, and specific and general. First of all, though, we'll look at the uh, conventional method. Uh, the conventional method starts with the uh, equation in the form y equals 2x minus 3, which is the same as this, but in, um, with y made as the subject. We take the gradient of the line uh, 2, that's this line, m equals 2, and the new line will have equation, uh, a gradient minus 1 over 2. That's the uh, property of uh, perpendicular gradients. And uh, so we put, we put this new gradient into the equation, y is minus a half x plus c, and we've got to find the value of c. So we take the um, coordinates, 6 and 2, and substitute them into uh, this equation, y is 2, x is 6, to find the value of c. So 2 equals minus a half times 6 plus c. And we can solve this very easily to find that c equals 5. And then we substitute this back into uh, our temporary equation here to find y equals minus a half x plus 5. Well, that's the conventional method. Now, the, um, the Wavic one-line method uh, takes uh, works like this. You take the coefficients of x and y and transpose them. So you get 1x and 2y. And you, you then change the sign in between the two terms. So from a minus to a plus in this case. And then using the specific and general rule, we apply the coordinates 6 and 2 to the left-hand side of this equation in order to obtain the right-hand side. So 1x is uh, 1 times 6 plus 2 times 3 is 6 at, uh, I'm sorry, it's 1 times 6 plus 2 times 2 is 10. So that's 1, 6 and 2, 2 is and that is the equation of the, of, of the line. And one, uh, one, one line of working there. Well, does it, is it the same as this? Yes. Uh, we can t transpose this equation, or transform this equation, by doubling all the terms. We get y, uh, 2y equals minus x plus 10. And then if we bring the x over, you see that x plus 2y is equal to 10. Well, this is the conventional method, and this is the one-line weighted method. Uh, I think I prefer this one.